Hi, this is Fabio Murri and here we are with another video for this series of the newest synchronized woodwinds packs. Today we meet the majestic contrabass clarinet, another instrument that you can purchase as a separate instrument if you are in need of this specific and peculiar monster clarinet. Let's start by checking out the most essential articulations that come with this product and then I'll have a very special orchestration tip for you at the end of this video, which is a bit more on the sound design side of orchestration. It's time to check how these articulations blend together with our usual musical phrase.
as I said, this time I'd like to propose an orchestration tip as peculiar as the contrabass clarinet. We move into the territory of a more modern way of orchestration, towards the boundary of sound design. I think the contrabass clarinet, with its rich and unmistakable timbre, is the perfect candidate for that. You will find several modern soundtracks, for example soundtracks by Colin Stetson, starting from advanced articulation samples of a solo instrument, which are then processed into creative and rich soundtracks. The great thing about synchronized instrument is that you can always turn off the convolution reverb to get back to the super dry sample of the instrument. This gives you much more control for sculpting your own sounds. And when I say super dry, I really mean that. The Synchron Player Mixer lets you process the sample directly within the Synchron Player. Here I apply the played reverb with a generous duration and wet percentage to the master bus. If you open the FX tab to the left side of the mixer, you can choose from quite a variety of FX plugins. Let's play it with some options. Compressor, a saturator and a chorus. The next step could be taking advantage of the real-time stretching feature incorporated in the Synchron Player. First of all, you may want to copy and paste the articulation you would like to process. Let's take the crescendo. You find the stretch feature in the Edit tab. Make sure the correct slot is selected and then just activate stretching. Play with the available parameters to decide how much you want to stretch the sound. In my case, I want the sound to be 5 times longer than its original length. For example, I can now adjust the attack and let's see how that sounds. You may want to rename your new slot, and it's that easy. Let's now see how that could work in context. To do so, I prepared just two instances of Synchron Strings FX1 to create, together with the processed contrabass clarinet, an interesting and menacing textural soundtrack. Thanks a lot for watching, I hope you found this video interesting, if you did make sure to check out the next video, we are going for a big change of register to check out the synchronized Obo Damore.